you know, last year we really didn't talk a lot about it, and certainly not having Michael Thomas it was a big part of it. And I think still he he's the the key here offensively uh, to get him back healthy because of just how good he is. But we've we made this long segment, man. The addition of Jarvis Landry, Chris Olave, and his speed and his ability to get up and make a catch. We see the improvement with Deontay Hardy as a route runner. Now, again, you're not going to get him any bigger. He is who he is. And then you see the young kids, if it's Aesop Winston Jr., if it's uh, Dejon Dixon from Nickel State, uh, you can kind of – Kurt Merritt uh, from Arkansas State. That's your hand, boy. And so that wide receiver group is an interesting group this year. Now, you've added some talent now. When you're talking about Jarvis and Olave, you've added big. And, you know, your big stick – is still not in the mix, but he's close. And, and Michael Thomas, it's a totally different group from a year ago. Mike, I agree a hundred percent. I mean, because now you talk about my number one receiver last year was in a situation where he was probably more so your number three guy, but he had to be your number one guy because of injuries. And so, when you talk about that, the type of defender that you're going to see now because of those top three guys that you just talked about, you know, Alave, you know, you talk about Jarvis, you talk about Mike, it's, it's, it's going to be a totally different look. And so that's a one-on-one that you should win every time because you're a, a, a better athlete than that other corner that you're going up against. And so, you know, I, I'm, I'm really intrigued to see how many receivers they carry. You know, I want to see the breakdown of how many tight ends – they carry you know and 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 even to right now Jarvis Landry has been the star yeah no he has been the star he has been the star as far as OTAs as well as minicamp uh he's been a star now you put pads on when you put pads on I don't think that changes he's gonna be even better yeah but I'm just saying I don't think that changes for him for some players, that will change. Some guys, uh, if you're a physical runner, then you, you're going to raise your level of play because now I can I can lay on you a little bit. I can touch you. You know, if 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 I don't look good just running around in in in, in space as a space player, then you kind of kind of wonder. Eh, I don't know if this is going to work out. But when you put pads on a guy like Jarvis Landry. His quickness is still going to be quickness. His explosion in short areas is still going to be there. So he will help to uh, take so much pressure off of Jameis, but also off of Mike Thomas, because now you talk about how Mike is so physical of a receiver, he will have another guy that can just get open, that can just make plays and get open. And so that, that's going to help. That's going to help Jameis tremendously. 